Rise up and run. In the 1981 British film Chariots of Fire, we are told the true story of two runners, Eric Little and Harold Abraham, who competed in the 1924 Olympic Games. One of the most memorable scenes happens when Eric Little is running in the France-Scotland competition. During the race, he's pushed down by another runner. He trips and falls as the runners continue running toward the finish line. But Little refuses to give up. And so he rises up to not only finish the race, but he overcomes the distance, the leaders, and wins the entire race. Every day, we wait to run the race marked out for us. There are moments when we fall. Sometimes we're pushed down. Other times we trip and fall on our own. And often when we fall, that's when we are tempted to stay down, believing we have lost the race. It's in those moments that we are at checkpoint 24. Galatians 5, 7 says, You were running the race so well. Who has held you back from following the truth? That truth? You're not down and out. The truth is you're down and ready to get up again. The truth is not only is your race winnable, it's already won. Jesus crossed that finish line on the cross and into the winner's circle when he emptied that grave. When you follow Jesus, you're really running a victory lap. So take his hand, receive his victory, and run again. Your race is not only winnable, it's already won. The decision each of us face in those moments is whether or not we will rise up and run again. Don't give up. Don't give in. This is discipleship. Following Jesus, being changed by Jesus, and committing to the mission of Jesus.